What's going on guys, Tech is here, wanna welcome you to more AC Odyssey, we're about to continue where we left off. There's a priest called Midon who does not want to let Cassandra know where to find her mother, by any means, so <laughs> I'ma give him a visit, you know, and see what's wrong with that dude, so <laughs> hop in, hopefully you will enjoy, and let's get this. Okay, so we gotta interrogate that dude, that elder priest at the gatehouse to know what's up, you know, he's he's so, so weird, does not want to help Cassandra, I don't know why, but he's so determined not to, so... Okay, don't mind me. Oh, he's inside here? The hell? Okay. We're gonna fight. Obviously. Let's take care of them first. Inside here. Oops. You know what, man? Come here. Take a look here. What about now? If I do it here, come here. Uh oh. Uh oh. oh. Damn. Hey. Hey man. What's up? Uh oh. Guards! They're dead. <laughs> and you must be Midon. He doesn't speak. So I've heard. I'm here to find out why. Chrysis did this to him. Uh -huh. I thought he did this to himself. To prove his loyalty to her. Now, why would Chrysis want an elder priest to cut out his tongue? Midon is a caring, generous man. I want answers from him. Not you. Tell me about the Spartan woman and her baby. He can only answer yes or no. Really? I know why you cut out your tongue. Was the woman's name Mirini? The Spartan woman. Was her name Mirini? Okay. Was the baby hers? Did Mirini say where she was going? Did she tell you where she was going? Of course. Is this girl yours? I don't give a fuck. They said she had a baby with her. Was it hers? No. Yeah? The baby was close to death when they arrived. Midon prayed for its life. Interesting. You saved the child. No. He did everything he could, but the baby was badly wounded. I know why Chrysis made you cut out your tongue. The night my mother brought my brother here, you and your priests left him for dead. And Rhesis didn't like you telling the story. That's not what happened! What do you know? You're too young to have been there. He told me the story many times before that witch stole his voice. He tried to save the baby, did everything he could. So they are talking about Alexius, the baby. I don't believe you! Dead! How can my baby be dead? I don't know what to tell you. You were lucky he survived as long as he did. That... that fall was devastating. <laughs> my baby! My baby! Listen, there's nothing we can do for you anymore. You'd best be on your way. Ray is here. <laughs> They're gone. They're both gone. 
Damn, man. So the cult took Alexis away from her. He wept for that Spartan woman so far from home. Her baby barely recognizable, hardly breathing. Shut up. <laughs> Tell me, please. I need to know. Not even Apollo could save the child. Medon told me how the Spartan woman wept, held the baby in her arms, sang to him, before finally leaving him to the gods. Chrysis took the baby, didn't she? And she made you cut out your tongue to hide the truth. Where is Chrysis? There is an altar where people offer their sick babies to be healed. This is where she took the child. Find it near the statue of Apollo Maleatas and you'll find Chrysis. People come to this sanctuary to heal. But I come here and find people dying without hope, priests without tongues, and babies left with an insane woman. <laughs> My mother was a fool to trust any of you. I'm going to find Chrysis, and she's going to pay for what she's done. Hush, my child. May Ira bless our sacred family. Okay, bitch. Gotcha now. Hey. So Chrysis is the key to finding my mother. She must find this altar of Apollo Maleatas. Hey. Ashes to ashes. Find and reach the first altar. Hey. There is the altar of Apollo Maleatas. We're going to reach that forest and kill that bitch who took Alexius. She's one of the cultists. No surprise, baby. And this game has so much content. I don't know what the hell. But I think we are just playing the game now for the sake, you know, of finding Cassandra's mother. There's the statue of Apollo and the altar. Chrysis will find a lot more than a helpless infant waiting for her. A warning. Must be getting close. Hey, help the crying baby. Hey, there's a crying baby here oh yeah I think that's the sanctuary where they heal babies easy buddy stop crying man All you what will die here. the hell didn't want to do that really Nope. Come on. Wanna bury it? They have so much health, man. Uh, that's dead, actually. She's going to die by the fire. She did not. Uh oh no! Damn. Yep, die. Okay. We gotta help that poor baby. Healing seems to run in your bloodline, almighty oh eagle bearer. Don't you dare speak of my family, snake. I still remember the night your mother brought me my child. The sad, pathetic thing, crying in the rain. 
Had I known then that Mirini had two children. But here you are. My family is complete. You let my mother believe her baby was dead. But he was. Oh, how she wept when his little heart stopped beating. But then I took care of him. Placed him on this very altar. Screamed for the gods to spare his life. And they listened. Hey, I'll kill you anyways, but what happened to my brother? What did you do with my brother? I saved his life. By teaching him to suffer. To know pain so well that he would learn to welcome it like an old friend. And now he will teach all of the Greek world to know that pain. You tortured him? He was just a baby! I taught him to survive. This world is cruel. It demands strength or death. So I gave him strength. Hey. Where did my mother go that night? That weakling crawled to the hills of Corinth. The monger was supposed to deliver her back to me, but she can't hide forever. She will give us more children. Ah, oh, no. I'll run my spear through your throat for the pain you've caused. <laughs> this world is pain. I gave the most strength to go. Your mother was a weakling who whined to the gods like a pig on an altar. I am more a mother to her child than she will ever be. I can be a mother to you too, Eagle Bear. This goes beyond my family. You and your cult are going to destroy the Greek world. You bring nothing but suffering. You talk of suffering and yet you come drenched in blood and threaten my life. You are a killer, just like your brother. Here. Let me show you. Oops. Oh no. We gotta help the baby. My child! This baby is yours? She was dying. Chrysis had me bring a gift to Ira so that he might be protected. Chrysis lit the temple on fire with the boy and me inside. Chrysis is a servant of Ira. She does what needs to be done. What needs to be done? She left your baby to burn alive. And you saved him. God bless you, Eagle Bearer. Sleep now, sweet child. Mater is here. I'm not sure saving that baby was the right thing to do. Chrysis's reign of terror must end. If what Chrysis said was true, Mirini believes my brother died long ago. I should have enough information now. I should head back to Athens to see Aspasia. I can't let Chrysis walk free. I'll kill that Malaka. Yeah, I gotta kill her. Return to Athens? What? Why? It was as if the gods themselves had infected and cursed Athens with the plague. Having found the clues required to locate her mother, Cassandra returned to find Aspasia. Okay, so we gotta go back to Athens to talk with Aspasia. So that lady, that old lady, Crisis or Crisis, whatever the name she got, was basically recruiting babies, you know, for the sake of the cult. And that's really nasty. Okay, so... I'm a fast travel to Athens now. Okay, here we go, guys. I know that dude. He's so familiar. Okay, we gotta talk to uh, Aspasia. I hope she's not one of the cultists, man. That would be fucked up. I hope, I really do. Man, what happened here? 
Holy shit! There is some kind of a plague or something like that. People are sick and dying here. Phoebe! Cassandra! You're back! But I ran sorry! Wait! Where? I'll be right back! See you at Aspasias! Sometimes I think you are too much like me. Sometimes I think she's better than you, Cassandra. And you have the right to be! Aspasia, please, tell me what the fuck is happening. Aspasia! Oh, Cassandra, you returned to Athens. What's left of Athens? The world we've built is crumbling at our feet. It's not looking good. <laughs> yeah, we have to hold it together. It's bleak, but it hasn't killed you. You're right. But everything Pericles has built is being destroyed. It's chaos outside these walls. People have forgotten how to be people. I came to talk to you. I found out some things about my mother. Her name, her shape... Cassandra, it's not the time. Pericles is dying. He won't see me. He won't let Hippocrates in his room. He only babbles about going to his precious Parthenon. I'm sorry about Pericles. I need to talk about Marini. Pericles is a strong man. I'm sure he can fight the sickness. You heard the mob. He can't defend himself. He'll die with no glory. Athens has known him a lot longer than they've known this plague. He gave them a voice. His accomplishments will speak for him. <sighs> Pericles needs treatment, and the gods know he won't let me in. He respects you. Could you go to him? Hell yeah. I could try. If you do, I will make the time to talk about your mother. For now, he needs your help. It's worth a shot. Oh, medicine, okay. Man, <laughs> okay. I mean, I think we eventually are getting to something here. Aspasia, my light. I told you. It's Cassandra. Yes, come in. It's embarrassing. Someone so strong. Seeing me like this. You look fine, you don't look good, yeah. I admit, you don't quite look yourself. I don't feel like myself either. I brought your drugs. Ah, yes. It's usually Phoebe who does the delivering. At least I'm alive. Though I can't say the same for my city. It's a shadow of what it was. Well, it will belong to Cleon now. He will have to lift it out of its sorry state. I wish to see it with my own eyes. Come to the balcony. Much has changed. I can't even stand up straight to look death in the eye. You'll recover sooner if you let Hippocrates see you. It's my time. The plague chooses no favorites. I fear I've failed Athens. It's people... Aspasia? No, you haven't. Ah, you're kind, but I've lost. Aspasia needs protection, as does Athens. I thought I gave enough to Athena, but it seems it isn't so. I should be out there, on the streets. You'd be overtaken. There are mobs, and Cleon's doing nothing to calm them. Thank the gods, Cleon won't see me like this. But that's all I can thank the gods for. They've turned on me. You can't blame the gods. The gods definitely aren't in Athens. I hardly recognize it here. It's like the Tartarus. Athens' fate is decreed. All we can do now is wait. You should go back inside. You need to rest. Where I should be is in the Parthenon. My greatest legacy to Athens. We need the gods' blessing. 
But Aspasia... Aspasia's right. She often is. But not about this. Yes. I'll go inside. Thank you, Cassandra. Tell my Aspasia I was a good boy and took my drugs. I will. Okay. Gonna talk to her now? Man, the dude is fucked up. Oh, sorry. Very please let me in. He took his drugs without complaint. Thank you. Something wrong? I expected Phoebe back by now. I saw her in the crowds outside. Did you send her somewhere? I had her go to Anastasios to see about a ferry. As soon as Pericles is strong enough, we're leaving Athens. We have to. But now she's missing. I'm sure she's all right. You shouldn't have sent her. She'll turn up. <laughs> Did Pericles tell you what I said about the cult in Athens? This cult? I thought it was his sickness speaking for him. It's true. But Phoebe's smart. She knows the way back. I hope so. I'm going to look for her. Where is Anastasios' house? It's across from the Odeon of Pericles. Here. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> How to get out of here? Ah. Yeah, get a climb. Okay. Find Phoebe and return with her to Aspasia. The hell, Phoebe? I mean, why did she go there? Man, that plague pretty much destroyed the whole city. That reminds me a little bit of, you know, that catastrophe happened in AC Rogue. I don't know if you can remember that or recall it. This looks like the place. Yeah. Hey, it's not gonna be easy, you know, getting Phoebe back. <laughs> that could be a cultist area, I don't know yet. Okay, we gotta enter from here. Hey, Phoebe. Let me get that first. By the gods! What happened here? Oh, shit! This gate? This was savage. Done to send a message. Okay. Demos must be carrying through on his threat. Oh yeah. Demos did that. For sure. Where is Phoebe anyways? I'm glad Phoebe wasn't here. Hopefully she's safe. Leave the house? Okay. Leave it. Wait. Protect Phoebe? God damn, what's happening here? Phoebe! No! Hey! Stop! Damn, this is gonna be savage. Phoebe! I'm fine! One down or two down. No, no, no. Okay, here we go. Phoebe. Oh shit, fuck me. Hello. I knew it. I knew it. Earth, mother of all, I greet you. You know what, I feel sad because she was good kid.
in the game. Anyazu. Cassandra! Are you all right? I need to speak to Aspasia. We must find Pericles first. He's missing. I don't fucking care! Tell me where Aspasia is! Cassandra! Yeah. I'm sorry. Save me. Aspasia went to find Pericles at the Parthenon. She should be there. I think we'd better go with her. I agree, my friend. I agree. We're gonna get killed, buddies. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. I really am very sad because Phoebe was helping and, you know, such a good kid in the game. They well presented her in the game, but I know it. I predicted that already, but uh, yeah. Catch you later and peace out.